to the Mommy and Me Show. Welcome back, everybody. Yes, we really appreciate so many of our subscribers. And yes, you're listening to the uh, the one and only Aaron Michael. Yes. So, Aaron Michael, what is your obsession with Darth Vader? I don't have an obsession with Darth Vader. Do you even know what obsession is? Because you said a session. Uh, no. Obsession. What ladder does obsession mean? Oh, I mean, it's like you, like, you love it. Like, you're, like, I'm, like, so fan of it. Like, I love this. Oh, my goodness. Do you know when um, there was an episode of Darth Vader when he um, burns all his body? Yeah. Your brother was about your age or younger. This is Mateo. Shout out. Um, Andre, thank you for being such a supportive brother. And he cried so much. There was all these business guys in the movie theater. And they're like, why would you bring your kid to watch Darth Vader? So what's the, what makes Darth Vader so magical? Darth Vader makes him so magical is because he... He, he's a good guy and a bad guy. He's bad guy. He was a good guy in the first, second, bad guy, then third, good guy. So from a kid's perspective, what happened? Like, he started good. Like, he was about your age, right? Superhero, helped uh, the battle in episode one. What transformed him into this person that killed so many people? The Emperor. So you think it's the Emperor, uh, Chancellor Pompatine, right? Yeah. Who's the one. So is it, but was that because of it, he was a bad influence? No, because you wanted to know who won the Clone Wars or the, um, what's it called again? The other war? Uh, the- oh, no, it's just the Clone Wars. So the bad side, he was on the bad side and the good side. So if he, um, if the good side won, he would go on the good side. If the bad side won, then he would go on the bad side. So, would it be, would you say that who you decide to hang around with makes a big influence on who you become in life? Yes. Yeah, so um, good friends are really important to have with. Like, I know that since your dad and I was uh, hung out with each other in good old Mission Dolores, now yep. Mission Dolores Academy, Right, we hung out with some friends who are super cool, great role models, and other ones that maybe not get some great decisions. So, what do you want our listeners to know about uh, about Darth Vader? We want to know about the we we didn't talk about his story, but today we're going to talk about his whole lifetime, nineteen ninety one to two thousand twenty two. Okay, go for it. You have to start it. I have to start it. Okay, he and was Mariah. Welcome to the Fonseca Mommy and Me show. So tell me. Well, let's read. Let's redo that. Welcome to the Fonseca Mommy and Misha. <laughs> Just want to give you, in case you forgot who we are. Me show. So now it's interesting. It's near the Easter holiday, and yes. did you know that? Uh, Anakin Skywalker, he had a mom, but no dad. Who does yes. that sound like? Who we celebrate on Easter? My dad. <laughs> he sounds like your dad? Yep. Yeah. Well, yeah, there are some kids who have never met their dad. Um, so did your dad start off as a good guy? Yes. And? A good. Did he end up as a bad guy like Darth Vader? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, my God. We better pack our bags, right? And he was a really, really good guy when he was 14 years old. He was a really good guy. Yeah, you know, I heard stories that your dad um, would wait for me at my high school at the bus stop. But you know what it really reminds me of is uh, Jesus Christ. I think Anakin Skywalker was like Jesus Christ, right? Uh, His mom, right, had him, and there was no father. There is that... Saint called Saint Joseph's, but he was kind of like that adopted dad, kind of like Uncle Frankie to your dad. Yeah. Right. Okay. So okay. So now Anakin gets discovered by the Jedi's. Yes. Okay. What did you think about that? That the Jedi's taking him away from mommy. Bad. Yeah. Right. I I feel that that Jedi disconnecting with the family is probably not the healthiest thing. How do you feel when you're with your folks? Awesome. Right? 
Everything is awesome. So, yeah,、uh, I don't know why there's that philosophy. I mean, I know you have more emotional, but then you just go, I don't know, family therapy or something. And then he gets to fall. And then in his younger age, has built his skill. He dis- discovers a brother like、um, feeling with Obi Wan Kenobi, correct? Yeah. By the way, are you excited about Obi Wan Kenobi coming out in May on Disney Plus? No. What? Oh my goodness. I think. It, 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 I saw it on.、Um, uh, it said it was really bad reviews. Oh my goodness. Now here. It's like one star. Well, let's hear about your review. So, right, your dad has a great big brother, your godfather, your uncle Richard. So, how do you think、uh, that plays a big influence in somebody's life? Maybe it will be me. You think you have a big influence? Maybe. Or you're talking about your brothers, Andre and Mattel, being a big influence on you? No, I think it's just me. It's just you. Okay, so. But Anakin does go just him and he gets married, doesn't he? Yep. Is that a no no or a okay? No, no. That's a no no, right? So, yeah, he gets married.、Uh, you know, I can't remember if it's before or after the Clone Wars, do you? Before. It was before, right? And then,、uh, then. Ooh, the ooh. Empire Strike Back. Yeah. Well, no, not the Empire Strikes Back, right? Because Anakin turns into Darth Vader, right? No. What? It's at the end of the movie. Which episode? Episode. There's a lot of episodes. Episode four. Well, you forgot episode three, where Anakin gets burned by Obi Wan Kenobi, his children get born,、uh, yes. his, his wife. Gets killed, unfortunately, by him. And then, wow, this is getting dark, right? Yeah.、Uh, and then、uh, the kids have to be separated so that,、uh, so th- you know, th- the bad guys don't find them. And then episode four is where it's called The New Hope. And who are, and we're introduced to not、Luke、only Skywalker and Princess Leia and Chewbacca. Right. So we don't get introduced that L- Darth Vader is the father. To Princess Leia or Luke Skywalker until Empire Strikes Back. Now, with him using the Force, don't you think when Princess Leia was captured in episode four, he would have known that his daughter? No. <laughs> no, I would think so. I would figure out if he has this Force or magic, that would be something great. And then what happens in the last episode six? Episode six? Well, you have to find out. No, it's called episode five. That's Empire Strikes Back. Yeah. Now we're talking about the return of the Jedi, right? Yeah. Where Luke saves the day and his dad. Well, it's, it's really. the universe. He did actually save the universe, right? It's, it's the power of love. Yeah. But now, do you think that would have been easy for a bad guy to change like that at the end? No. No. Okay, so there's a power、That's、of、really、choice. It's really hard. It is, okay, so it is really hard, right?、Uh, yeah. But it, it lasts a lifetime, your choices, right? So, what, I, you know, that's why I always say, like, take a pause and make a decision. And it was nice that、uh, Darth Vader returned to、um, somewhat his loving self. Yeah. That's good. Now, we have another review. Can you tell me what you and your dad? Um, who happens to wear the Darth Vader costume quite a bit? Watch、uh, this past week.、Uh, we watched,、um, what is it called again? Hmm. Hmm. It was so good, you forgot the name of it. Yes. It, it, was the number, it was the number one movie in the box office. Now, how do you know it's the number one movie in the box office? Because、um, it says that. It does. Well, I believe it's Sonic. Oops, so sorry.、Uh, I believe it was Sonic the Hedgehog.、Um, <laughs> now comes all the run. Part two. So tell our readers what is a hedgehog in Sonic. That's for next episode. No, no. Are you kidding me? People want to know what movie is out. We, let's go talk about Sonic Hedgehog. We finished our Vader 2. Yes. So, we need to talk about part three now. Am I right? Okay, I don't know about you guys. I feel very confused.、Um, so, are we. 
I thought we we're going to talk about Sonic Hedgehog. Or are you done with? Uh, see, this is why planning and making good she- decisions is really important. I said, I said, we should have done Sonic the Hedgehog second, but you probably didn't listen. I did. I thought that's this is the second part of no, our show. Next episode. Okay, so that wouldn't be part two. That would be a brand new episode. Yes, so the reader part two is the end. Okay, we'll let our wonderful producer Fonseca kind of decide what to do at the end of this. Everyone, thank you so much for listening. Uh, Please go ahead and subscribe to uh, more episodes to come. As you know, there's a Sonic Hedgehog review coming up. Big shout out to Aaron Fonseca, our producer, editor. Yes, he's also a producer of your Nerd Side College for All and SI Counseling. So, uh, and don't, and I forget that. I just had a good idea for after the Sonic the Hedgehog. Okay, maybe we'll just, pl- why don't we go to the planning room and make it a secret and then produce it? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. All right, everybody, until next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>